Hi guys, welcome to another video with Melissa. Today we are doing a uh, nostalgic unboxing of my Lost Season 5 Blu-ray set which came in this awesome Dharma Initiative Orientation box. Uh, this is an American set. Unfortunately, I live in Britain and my DVD player <laughs> um, and Blu-ray player are British. So I have not actually watched the set. I bought it mainly because I love the Dharma Initiative. Um, this set came out in 2009, so it's about seven years old now. And it came in this like really battered water, well, fake water, water stained box. And it is just such a cool DVD set. Um, so I'll just open it up for you guys so I can show you. I don't think I've opened this since I got it and I can't remember what comes in it. Let's see. Let's see, let's get this open. Okay, so what do we have? I don't remember at all. Seriously, it's been seven years. What is this? This is, oh, that's just the outside that I put it inside. That was what came around it. Okay, put that down. Okay, so it comes in this orientation folder. Bit like what they had on the show. Quite cool. And then you open it up. Let's put that back so we can see it properly. It looks like this. So the first thing you get is you got a videotape. I actually never played the videotape. I have seen when it's on it because I watched on YouTube shortly after the set came out. I didn't have a VHS player anymore. But it is an actual VHS, um, and it has some of the, um, it has an orientation film on it that's supposed to tie into the DVD set. On the other side, we have, it says, Storm Initiative, uh, map schedules and services. In this section, you will find information about people and the amenities that are offered. Um, please take a moment to read and familiarize yourself with with your time here, be safe and pleasant. Namaste. So let's take some of this out so we can see. So we've got, I'll just actually do the clips, that'll be easier. Okay, so I lift that up so we can see properly. So that's the first folder that's in there. And you get some leaflets. I just love how this was put together because I love, the Arm Initiative was actually my favorite thing about Lost. And we've got, a little welcome thing here. Let's save the world together from Horus. We've got Horus up here. And we've got a picture of the Dharma Initiative. And welcome to our island where we're building a prosperous future that we can support, enrich, and cradle all in a peaceful society. That's so cool. Okay, and then we've got some other bits. We first thing we've got is getting to know your way around. And we've got a map of the Dharma Initiative. So we've got a welcome center, school, a cafeteria, playground, security office, motor pool, infirmary, and recreation room. And they are all color coded on the maps. So that's really neat. Uh, so we've got the Dharma motor pool. I love that they have their own symbols as well. So we've got this one has a wrench in the middle. Um, so this talks about you can hire cars from them if you're planning a trip anywhere. So there we go, there's that. Um, it says vans and jeeps are available um, for use as needed by authorized personnel only. As a new recruit, take a moment and get acquainted with all the services a motor pool has to offer. There are eight vans and four jeeps apparently on the island. Uh, and then when you go out on the road, you have to take a walkie talkie with you, it looks like. Um, and you have to be, when you're 15 years old, you can obtain a learner's permit. And at 16, you can apply for a part-time job with the motor pool. Um, and it just tells you a bit about more about the cars and the motor pool on the back there. Okay. And then we have the Dharma Initiative Cafeteria. And we've got the food pyramid telling you to have a balanced diet. Due to the... Um, Local climate on the island, nature of your work. Please take precautions in maintaining proper levels of hydration throughout the course of your day. And we've got like a medical symbol. That's quite a cool one. Um, and we've got a lunch menu. So that's neat. 
So things that they would eat in the Dharma Initiative, uh, spaghetti with marinara sauce or tossed salad, hard roll and butter, baked apple, farm fresh milk. <laughs> it was have a cow. Uh, sloppy Joe in a bun, peanut butter and jelly sandwich, vegetarian option apparently, uh, potato sticks, pickle chips, coconut pie, fresh squeezed lemonade, tacos with ground beef for Tuesday, or bean burrito, beans, rice, guacamole dip, custard with a caramel sauce, Wednesday, ham and cheese with a special garlic mayo, macaroni and cheese, um, I gotta read through all these. Thursday, tuna noodle casserole, stew with vegetables. Uh, Friday, grilled cheese sandwich, tomato soup. Saturday, wiener on bun or burger on bun or vegetarian chili. And then Sunday, waffles with special dipping sauce and fresh scrambled eggs. And then we've got the, um, the hours of operation on the back here. They've really, like, done quite a lot to, like, make this. Which is so cool that they put the effort into this kind of sap. I can't remember how much this retailed for. I think it was about like $60. And then the next folder we've got here is a uh, Dharma Initiative Rules and Regulations for Security. I'll just take those out as well. So we've got the security team. We got a leaflet about them. And that one's got a little star for like a little sheriff. And Dharma Security welcomes you. And we've got even a there is fire and safety prevention class are offered by the security team on the 23rd of every month, apparently. I was looking to see if there was a phone number. I remember there being some kind of phone number to call. Um, and safety first. And then we've got about the solar fence on the back here. For your protection, the wildlife from the island, the barracks are surrounded by a high frequency so sonar fence. Um, Disarmament code. The five digit code is required to arm and disarm this sonar fence. These codes are changed daily. Please be sure to obtain a daily copy of security office. Uh, keypad is located toward the bomb the pile for disarmament. Early warning system has been established in case you under duress an intruder disarm the fence. If you find yourself in this situation, it's 1623. <laughs> Once code 14 jades entered, the automated system will warn the barracks population of the intruder. Uh, security, um, personal security code, find yourself off the sonar fence without a code. You have been assigned personal security code. If you enter this code, a member of the security team will arrive to assist you as soon as possible. And ours is like faded out. <laughs> this starts with uh, 42, looks like 143. Uh, and it says, thank you for being part of the Dharma Initiative here. Uh, read the following instructions carefully. Please stay within your living quarter. Please listen to the staff of the Dharma Initiative. Uh, taking an aptitude test, apparently. Answer the best you can. There are no exceptions and changes once you've taken the Dharma Initiative aptitude test. So you're stuck with that job. And you have to sign the date at the bottom of it. I forgot how cool this set was, guys. It's been a while since I looked at this, so I think the last time I looked at this is when I bought it. Let's put that back in there. The folder's coming out. It is a really neat set. Okay, and then you have the really cool little patches for your work uniform. It tells you how you can attach them. All right, well, this is open up the package. I can take them out. Oh, I can see. So we've got the uh, the kitchen one. It's got ABC Student Studios on the back. We've got the lamppost, I think it was. The security ones. And, of course, the normal Dharma ones. And these are really cool, guys. I'm, I'm so... I forgot all about these. I mean, they're just so neat. Let me just go back the other way so I can see them. And then, um, after the security little patches on here. Let's put them back in here. We have actually got our DVD set. And a CD, I forgot about that. Geronimo um, Jackson's in there. So our CD, um, our DVDs come like this. So we got orientation session one and two, three and four. And they are supposed to look like floppy disks, which I think they look really cool. Um, and they all, they come out. You can take one out, have a look, and you've even got the pattern on the back as well. And they look like this when you take them out. They're just a standard Blu-ray disc once you've taken them out of the packaging. 
but I think this is just so nicely packaged um, to make it look legitimately old. So you've got those ones, and this is just season five, and then you've got a Geronimo Jackson CD at the bottom here, and I'll just take that out. So Geronimo Jackson, for you guys that don't remember, are the band that we hear playing on the Dharma Initiative. I can't remember the name of the song. Uh, Dharma Lady, apparently. Dharma Lady. <laughs> so you get that as well with the set. I should put that on my um, iPod actually. I forgot about that. And then in the back, we've got a security folder that says confidential on it. Uh, this is the last item. Um, so let's have a look. Oh my goodness, have I not opened it? Oh, actually I can't open it guys. It's not open. I have not opened this. Ooh, do I open it? I probably will leave it actually. I probably won't open it guys just because I don't want to decrease the value. I don't, I think I've looked up what's in there before. Nah, I'm not going to open it. I've kept the set in good condition for the last seven years, so I'm not going to open it. Um, and that is my Dharma Initiative Season 5 um, U.S. Blu-ray set. It comes with videotape, CD, and also Season 5 discs and like some leaflets as well to go with there. Um, it is a really neat looking set. I mean, I keep it in the original box because the box also looks quite cool with um, it being water damaged and looking like there's tape on it. Um, I think it's quite neat. So, um, I think you probably could pick these up on eBay quite cheaply now. I mean, the, I think it was a limited number of them, but I don't remember how many, and I really just wanted the set because I thought it was so cool. And we don't often get these kinds of really cool sets in the UK, so that was my nostalgic bo unboxing. Um, if you guys would like to subscribe, I'm trying to get to 50 subscribers at the moment, so please click the subscribe button. Once we get to 50 subscribers, we will be having a giveaway. So please keep checking my channel for that in the future. And thanks for watching, guys. Bye.